All right, okay. I think we're all good now. Sorry for that. Sorry about that, guys. I think we're all better now. I've I've brought all my I've restarted my OBS, so we're all good there. Give me one second to make sure I've got all my docs in place so I don't miss anything. Um, I think we fixed it, which is good, which is very, very, very good. Okay, make sure I got that up. Okay, all right, awesome. I think we fixed it. How are we doing? Did we survive that? Are we doing okay? Hello, is everyone doing okay? Welcome back, welcome back. All right, sorry, let me get caught up on the chat real quick. I'm glad that was a quick fix because it looked very scary at first. <laughs> <laughs> um, let me get caught up on the chat real quick. The aspect ratio did change temporarily, but looks like it's better now. Yeah, I don't know. <clears throat> anyway, what we were talking about was very homophobic that stream just shut down right then. Anyway, um, gender is a construct and you are allowed to define it however you want. Absolutely. I love wearing binders and like my booba has been causing me some dysphoria lately. Okay, yeah, that that's completely valid. The way that you're feeling right now is valid. Um, dude, I'm so excited because at work, public library, I'm talking to a local LGBTQIA plus organization about setting up a transition fair where we can have local gender affirming clinic present for medical questions, transition closet, and lawyers present from the, from the law school and legal aid to legally change people's names. That's so cool. That is so cool. Oh my goodness. I love that. That sounds amazing. The hardest part would be my parents. Understandable. Yeah, and you know, if you're still in a place where you're not independent or on your own, that could also be very, very difficult as well. So the parents are something to deal with. And I hope that there is a solution that you can come up with that allows you to you know, have these gender affirming, you know, options available to you. I hope that that all the pieces line up, you know? I'm so excited. We're trying to plan it for June. Oh, that's so exciting. That is so exciting. Goodness. Yeah, we are always here to affirm you. We are always here to affirm you, Julian. You are wonderful. You are valid. And we're here. We're here for you. We got you, you know. Um, in Arkansas, it's super easy to change your gender on your ID. You literally just walk in and say, I want to change the gender marker on my ID. And they're supposed to say M, F, or X. That's incredible. And you know what? You don't expect that. You don't expect that for Arkansas because it's in the South, right? You, it's not something you would you would think that would that would be available. Um, and it is. And that's super amazing. And uh, it's progress for sure. It's progress for sure. And if they don't and if they don't call you call them out because they're breaking the law. Hell yes. Hell yes. Me ready to fight for trans rights. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, I'm fairly comfortable with my pronouns and being a woman, but I don't want boobs. Completely valid. Completely valid. Like I was saying before I got cut off, I know several, several lesbians or sapphic individuals that their gender is just simply lesbian. Like, that's just it. They don't want to define their, their gender as anything else. They're not a woman. They're not a man, you know? Um, and uh, my, my ex was actually the kind of person that was like, you know what? I'm not your girlfriend. I am just your significant other or your butch, you know? And that was completely valid. I was like, okay, yeah, sure. Just let me know and I can change that, you know, of how I speak about you. Yeah. Um, Julian, you are not alone. Your gender presentation is quite similar to mine, ideal and all, except I use they, them, and I'm and and use non-binary. There you go. I use she, they, and I'm fairly sure I'm a woman. It's all personal anyway, it's whatever. I look so sexy when my chest is flat, guys. I want that five ever. <laughs> you are so valid. I will say that until the cows come home. You are so valid, Julian. And I I hope that, like I said earlier, I hope all the pieces line up. I hope all the pieces line up so you can have that happen. Yeah. Oh, okay. Scotty's giving me all the details about what went wrong with my computer. This is good. All right, it's definitely a GPU fuck up or a display fuck up. Okay, it usually does that when it's trying to figure out how the fuck to present an image like upon first installation. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. This is the first time I've talked about it. Aw. Julian, we're here for you, and I'm glad that we have this this, this safe space for you to talk about that. I'm, I'm really happy that we could all be here for you and, and just affirm you and let you know how valid you are. Stop, Scotty. Stop. You you don't mean that, right? You know it's Arkansas, right? You know it's Arkansas, right? Not Arcan Arkansas. You know it's Arkansas. You know it's Arkansas. 
know it's Illinois, right? Not Illinois. Oh, dear. We got a Brit in the house. Oh, gosh. Oh, goodness, you guys. Oh, my goodness. All right, I'm going to have a pizza night with my roomie. Oh, that sounds so nice. Oh, my goodness. Enjoy your pizza, Julian. Hopefully, we'll see you again very soon. We love you. We absolutely do. All right, let me pull up my Sims again. Make sure everything is working. Make sure my desktop audio is working. Okay, we're good. We should be good. Um, I mentally read, read it Arcan, Arcan Sass. Like, sass rhymes with pass? That's not correct. That is incorrect. It is Arkansas. Or at least that's how we pronounce it over here in the States. Um, we do stand, Julian. Can I have the Britophobic role? I think, can you assign that to yourself? I'm pretty sure you can. Uh, in our, in our Discord, which we're only two away from, people. We are only two away. It's very exciting. All right. Let me switch over to here. Oh dear. Okay, good. All right. Uh, my Sims game is a little bit off. I apologize for that. It's a little bit wonky. I can't fix it right now, but uh, when I do redo my overlays, which I will probably do eventually here, um, I will probably um, <laughs> uh, fix it so it doesn't overlap with chat and doesn't look weird and funky. So we'll get on that. We'll get on that. Yeah. Illinois makes sense because it's probably French, but Arkansas is doing a hate crime on me. I think it has something to do with the language of origin, but that could be a myth. Um, I don't know for a fact if Arkansas is French or if Arkansas is like a native word. Um, I know like, I think Chicago is a native word. Um, and I don't know about Illinois either. Illinois could be French or it could, could not be. So I don't know the origin of it. Um, but that's just simply, I know how we say it over here. So that's what, that's what I know. All right. The Sims 4, it just works. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay. All right, people. Why don't we hop into this? Why don't we hop into this? Would pay money for Liz to play Sims 3 live on stream so I could enjoy the, enjoy the reactions. I would consider it. I would consider it. I don't know how much a Sims 3 costs, but I would consider it. Um, I've also seen like people like Little Simsies, uh, Little Simsy, I forget if Little Simsy plural or not, but um, she's a very popular Sims streamer and she has played uh, The Sims Medieval on stream before and so I thought that was kind of interesting too, I would play that. <laughs> um, but yeah, but right now, can we hop into our lovely Tegan? We love Tegan, oh my goodness. Oh, I know why it's funky, hang on. Maybe I do know why it's funky. That's it. Oh dear. Hang on. No, not like that. Don't fix it like that. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. That's, that's not correct. That is not correct. Hang on. Oh lord. This is... Sims. Actually, that kind of looks better. I'm kind of glad I fixed that. Alright. Is that okay? Does that, does that look alright? That look all right. We're doing okay. The chat is now off. It's fun. We're just we're just doing this live. It's still retrograde, by the way. Retrograde will end. Oh wait, no, maybe it's not. Is today the last day of retrograde? Is today the last day of retrograde? Hello, hello. It might be. It's <laughs> just like that. It's worse. <laughs> oh dear. I think I fixed it now. Oh Maddie, hello, hello Maddie. I've got you on while I do my makeup. Oh, that's awesome. I love that part of your pre-stream routine right now. That's awesome. If you're doing a stream, I, I assume if you're doing your makeup now, you're doing a stream. Um, so maybe if you're on by the time we end, maybe we'll raid you. Um, but hello, Maddie. How's your day going? How are you doing, love? How's it going? Yeah, we're about to, we're just hopping into The Sims right now. It's been several minutes and we've already had te technical difficulty, but it's fine. <laughs> it's so good to see you. All right, let's figure out what the heck we were doing because I do not remember. Oh, Tegan, oh, darling, what is going on with you today? Let's find out, let's find out. Okay, first of all, Tegan, it's time to take a pog shit, as we say here on this channel. 
Um, I swear I'm gonna get you that technical difficulty sign. <laughs> I need to I need to adjust my sign back there because it says one day since our last technical difficulty and that is no longer true. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, oh, I gotta pause and read this. Hang on. Arkansas is from the Quapa people, and the word is from the Algon Algonquian language. It's spelled French and pronounced for the original language. Two senators in early statehood fought about how to spell and pronounce. Good to know. Good to know. The more you know. We need that as a sound also. That's very interesting. Thank you, Ollie. Ollie's very good at research, so Ollie is very good at letting us know what is what. <laughs> All right, uh, Tegan, Tegan, my darling, I know you're playing a keyboard game, which I probably told you to do. Probably told you to do that, but you don't need to do that right now because you already finished your motor skills. You need to go take a pog shit. <laughs> I love the screaming going on in chat right now. Okay, Tegan, what do we do next with you, babe? All right, three emotional potions, achieve level 10 mental skill. We've already got two of our, two of our aspirations down, so we're doing very good right now. Um... We have nothing in the, in the social butterfly milestones. This is fine. This is fine. She's just not very social. Emotional potions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That is a thing that we can do. Emotional potions. <laughs> uh huh. Emotional. <laughs> That's very good, Scotty. I like that a lot. <laughs> um. Right now. Why don't we go see if we can craft a potion and then we'll probably be sending her to get a uh, shower. Let's see what we can get. We can only do a health potion right now, which means her mental skill is probably not that high. Yeah, her mental and social skill is clearly not what we have been working on so far. <laughs> oh, the computer did break again. Hey, but we have someone here who is very good at fixing things. I believe her repair skill, I believe Aaliyah's repair skill is very good. So we're going to send her up there to fix that. Um... Okay, we've got we've got creativity and we've got motor skill done. So we have to work on social and mental. That's what we gotta focus on today, folks. And you know what? I think we can do it. I think we can do it. Okay, she's made a health potion. This is good. Um Tegan, looks like your mom is going to work. Okay, there you go. Um that means Tegan will be home alone to her to her own devices. <laughs> um I really wanna do it is Tegan City now. T Tegan City now. <laughs> I really want to get um, Tegan's like click together. We need her to have a squad. You know, we need her to have her people that she she could connects with and are also the leaders of her protection racket. You know, you know, it's what she needs. Um, for now, why don't we have her work on her mental skills while I take a look real quick. Um. She's part of these guys. I don't know if these guys are her squad or not. I don't know if these guys are it. You know? You know? I don't know. We really got to work on that. We're going to we're going to figure that out today, I think. Um, uh-oh, dirty dishes are piling up and Aaliyah can't keep up. You can either overload overload the dishwasher or give up and leave some dishes unwashed. Um <laughs> I'm going to say leave the dishes unwashed because you'll just have to make another load because that's what happens sometimes. That's currently what's happening with us in our house. Margaret has done the dishes like yesterday and then all of a sudden it seems like we have dishes piled up again. So that is my job next time. It's just like, you know what? Sometimes it's like that. Sometimes the dishes just pile up and that's just like, it's, a, it's an eternal cycle of always needing to do dishes and laundry. That's it. That's life over and over again. Dishes, laundry, and picking what you want to eat for dinner. That is that is the only true constants in life right now. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Miles got a promotion, which is awesome. We really needed that. Um, I don't know what Miles is going to do now. Uh, there you go. It's good to know your limits. Leaving a few dishes unwashed isn't the end of the world. Sweet. All right. Um, I wonder if... Miles joining the game will help. The family is raking in money. We are doing much better when it comes to the amount of money that we have, which is good because I think, so my goal actually, once we get Tegan to be a uh, a teenager, I would like to do a, a chill building stream where I will just put on some lo-fi music and we will build a little house for Tegan. Um, and I'm really looking forward to it, and I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. I don't know if we should do it for her when she's a teenager or when she's an adult, though. That's my only thing that I'm like, 
on the fence about, you know? Um, but yeah, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. We're gonna need food. We're gonna need, not food. We're gonna need money is the thing we're gonna need. So, okay, mental level six, research on Simpedia. Good, so when she takes down people with her internet quips, she could be deadly accurate. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, this is good. I want to be a ninja when I grow up. What do I need to do to, now to start getting ready for being a ninja when I'm growing up? Um, um, let's see. Um, this is a good question. A good question. I think. <laughs> oh, man. Should Tegan be a secret agent one day? That's what I'm thinking about right now is Tegan as, as a secret agent. <laughs> Tegan would be deadly. Oh my goodness. She does need stealth. I think we're to say start practicing. Start practicing your hiding. Responsibility decreases. This is good. This is fine. This is fine. <laughs> Tegan just became good friends with Miles. That's your dad. It sure is. Damn, I wish that was me. Oh gosh. Ouch. Ouch. Oh dear. <laughs> All right, you went and took a nap. All right, that's fine. Okay, perfect. We've got a squad member coming out. I think Mika is definitely going to be one of our squad mates. Um, because Mika came over and did her homework at our house once and then left her homework there and then came back the next day with new homework and her homework still sits here. So I think Mika is now officially part of the squad. <laughs> um, we want to real quick do we... No, we'll probably wait till they're teenagers, I think. But Mika is going to be part of the squad. Why don't we make that? Why don't we make that a, a club? Why don't we do that? Hang on. Um, create a club. This is good. <laughs> Leaving her mark. Unfinished homework. <laughs> She's evading bans because she keeps changing politician wikis to dumb shit. <laughs> She's gonna make articles. Yeah, absolutely. She is gonna make articles on Simpedia. She's the type of sim to um actually people even on the internet, and she's gonna make her word law. <laughs> Um, all right, let's say, why don't we call this, um, um, uh, what do we want to say? Tegan's squad? Tegan's racket? Tegan's, um, Chanel number one. Chanel, Chanel number two. <laughs> what do we want to call this? Give it a, no, I'm not giving it a gang name. We're going to say, we're going to say squad. We're going to take it back to like 2014 when everyone said squad all the time. Said squad all the time. All right. <laughs> Someone want to tell my cat not to stick her nose in my mouth? Hey cat, do it more. <laughs> oh, tea gang, miscellaneous gaze. Oh, these are good. Tea gang. Oh, that's really good though. That is really good though. With the hyphen? With the hyphen, you think? Do kind of like that. I do kind of like that. Um, why don't we do? <laughs> oh dear. Um, why don't we do? Do we do a bear, or do you want to do the the death side? <laughs> do that. We could be. Not a laundry fire. <laughs> Diamond, cause they're all gems. Perfect. Perfect. What is it? There's an Ariana Grande song about that, about buying rings for your friends. Seven rings, I think. Yep. Yep. Definitely. Um, we're going to add Mika. Mika Akiyama. She is a part of the squad. Um, requirements. Must be Tegan's friend. <laughs> um, let's do for now... Uh... Let's not mess with this yet, because we need to have more members, but we're just going to have that for now. We're just going to do that for now. Okay, wait, don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Where are you going, babe? Where are you going? What's going on? Oh, we had groceries delivered that nobody went out and got. You think those are all expired now? <laughs> I think those are all expired now. Wait, where are you going? Is she going to go into the backyard? Let us see what she's doing. I don't know. <laughs> Add Mortimer? Wait. Wait, wait, you know who she did become friends with? Should she become friends with the vampire? <laughs> she did have a very interesting um conversation with him in a uh a cafe at one point, so you know, it kind of fits. I don't know, it kind of fits. She's just collecting collecting powerful people. <laughs> 
Um, let's see. Should we get her to be friends with, like, one of the wizards? So she has, like, an in when she starts learning her magical powers? Thinking about it. I am thinking about it. Uh, for now, why don't we keep with just Strahd and Miki? <laughs> this is perfect. I think this is perfect, personally. I think this is perfect. I don't see any problem with this. I see zero problems with this. This is fine. All right. Um, yeah, I hope all those groceries are good after being left on the porch. Um, let's find out, shall we? Um, yeah. Okay, the lettuce is spoiled. That's fun. <laughs> um, peas are normal. Okay, all right, so it's just the lettuce that got fucked up. That's fine. Just gonna actually just clean out the spoiled food. All right, do that real quick. A totally normal guy, a to totally normal friend group. Two young girls and that guy. Their friend, Steve. That's the chaperone. Ignore the fact that he's 600 years old and evil. <laughs> Oh, this is incredible. I am very pleased with this. All right. Is Tegan done her homework? Probably should do that real quick. Um, and then we'll have her get some food because our girl is, our girl is hungry. You know, she, she deserves to be not hungry. Oh, and then maybe we'll hang out with Miki and work on our, um, there's things in the backyard that I just saw and I'm confused about. Why is, why is it stinky out here? Why are things stinky out here? Hello? Dispose of dead plant. That would be good. What is your diary doing out here? Oh, it's not your diary. Miki left her diary here? Miki, no. No. Oh, that's not good. Miki, you need to be more careful with that. Clearly, you're not going to be up for secretary of, T of the tea gang. Clearly, that's not what's going to happen here. Okay. <laughs> Miki trusts us implicitly. <laughs> Miki's loyalty is already is already out there. She left it for Tegan to find so that she could so Tegan could read all of her diary entries about how much she thinks Tegan is the best. That's a mistake. Miki knows to keep no secrets between her and her boss. <laughs> Absolutely. Miki knows best. Miki knows better, you know? Um, okay, can you finish up with your homework so that we can talk to Miki and raise your social skill? Because you do have, like, you have zero social skills right now, my love. Tegan, you do not know very much about social environments, which, you know what? I understand. I get it. <laughs> this is gonna be her second, I think. You know? You know? Joke about nacho cheese. Can you get- okay. There is a secret aspiration that is the grilled cheese aspiration that I just learned about. Oh, thank you for the posture check. Thank you for the posture check. I do need that because I tend to slump in my chair and that's not good for anything. Or it's, it's also not good for when I'm trying to make TikToks and then like my face is half cut off because I was slouching at the time. So yeah, thank you for that. Thank you for that. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so Scotty let me know about the grilled cheese secret aspiration. And so I'm curious if you have to be a adult or a young adult or teenager to get that aspiration or if you can get it as a child. I would assume that you can't as a child, but we will find out. Not as a child. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Good to know. Um we're just going to we're just going to start chatting, you know? We gotta raise that social skill. Um, oh, and she's get she's getting badges for that too, which is awesome. Cause I did want to give her all of the badges before she turned into a teenager. <laughs> teenager unsure, definitely for young adults and up. Okay, good to know. Good to know. All right, let's keep chatting. Play make believe. There you go. Um, tell a goofy story. Hey Miki, remember that time that you left your homework here? Haha, <laughs> lol. Oh dear. All right. Is that raising your score? It is. Okay, we're doing fine. We're doing fine. Just keep chatting with your second. Just this is a this is a meeting. All right. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Tegan needs to go to bed anyhow. Um, let's send Tegan up to sleep. Um, everyone else is already in bed. That's fine. Why are you taking a nap when you need to be sleeping? Just go. Just get under the covers. It's it's fine. It's bedtime. 
sometimes these things. All right, turn off that because that's me blaring in the middle of the night just for it to break again. <laughs> the young girl will walk home alone. It's fine. She's in the tea gang. She's protected. People know better than to fuck with her. They know better. You know why? Because you know who else is in the tea gang? A 600 year old vampire. It's, <laughs> it's fine. Vlad is walking her home. <laughs> exactly. You get it. You understand. So she's fine. Totally fine. Um, <laughs> right. The vampire. Totally fine. Absolutely. Absolutely. That's a child. Vampire doesn't go after people like that. Vampire's not so going after. You have chosen death. <laughs> is that Miki? <laughs> is that when when a, when a stranger walks up to Miki while Vlad is walking her home? It's so you have chosen death. That seems about <laughs> that seems about accurate. How Vlad accidentally adopted two daughters. The story. <laughs> Uh, I think that sounds wonderful and we need to adopt more. We need more children in this group. So we're going to fast forward until Tegan is close enough to being, you know, oh, well rested. Dear, I want to cheat so bad right now. I need you to know I want to cheat so bad right now and give her her um, just just do a, a make all of her needs green. I want to do that so bad right now. I'm not going to. But I had that feeling where, like, my hand moved towards it. And then, then I remembered that we're not doing that right now, which is fine. We need more children, Liz Bevy 2022. <laughs> don't take that out of context. <laughs> I don't need children. I don't need that right now. Vlad was empty until he got invited to Tegan's tea party. <laughs> tea party! Where they discussed world domination and he discovered purpose? Stop. I'm so sorry. Tea Gang is very good, but Tea Party is better. I'm sorry. Tea Party is better. Tea Party. It's a tea party. Stop, please. I love it so much. Hang on. I'm writing that down. <laughs> I'm writing down. Um. <laughs> Um, one tea party changed a lonely vampire's life. I need an apostrophe and then we are good to go. That's not an apostrophe. I know words and letters and symbols. <laughs> no bitch, the tea gang has tea parties? Oh, I'm torn. <laughs> I'm so torn. Hang on, we need a poll. We need a poll. Hang on. We need a poll. We need a we need a poll. We need um name the squad. We need to know. Okay, is it T Gang? Or T Party? I need to know. I need to know. Start poll. Again. <laughs> Let me know. Let me know in the chat. What do you guys think? All right, so we're going to send her to school and hope that she finds some new friends at school as well. We need more people to adopt. That's what we need. Go to work, bitch. Hello? All right. Make friends. And influence people. All right. Let's see what this poll is doing. We have four votes for T Gang. <laughs> oh, no. And our water got shut off. Oh, dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Hang on. Pause. <laughs> oh, hi, Bean Daddy. Hi, how's it going? How are you doing? How was your birthday yesterday? You had a very fun stream. I really enjoyed your stream yesterday. <laughs> oh dear. I hope you had a good day yesterday. How's your day going today? <laughs> um, I need to make sure that we've paid our bills. Oh gosh, our bills are so much. Why are our bills so much? Jeez, Louise. All right, I'll change it back to tea gang when she gets back from school. It's fine. Birthday was lit. Hell yes. We love to hear it. We love to hear it. Okay, we've met Alexander, who looks to be a uh, a scout, which is a good match for Tegan, I think. Um, it's because the house is huge and everything just stays on. I have auto lights off. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, I have inspired you to buy The Sims. <gasps> EA, did you hear that? I'm an influencer now. You should pay me. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, that's awesome. I hope you enjoy playing The Sims. I really enjoy playing The Sims as you can as you can see. So, yeah, that's awesome. Maybe we'll get to see you stream it one time. I don't know. That would be fun to see. <laughs> um, uh-oh. Tegan spent most of recess running around trying to kiss some of the other students. Tegan, that's not what I meant when I sent you to school to make friends. Tegan, that's not how you make friends. Oh dear. She didn't catch enough, catch anybody, but the other students were running away. Oh gosh. Oh dear. <laughs> what should we do? Oh no. <laughs> At EA, where's the partnership? <laughs> Absolutely. EA, hit me up, baby. Take me out to dinner. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> oh, dear. Sims is insanely fun. I've sunk so much into three and four. I hope you have a rad time. Yeah. <laughs> Sims just works. Tegan asked for consent first. She didn't understand. She did not understand the assignment. Tegan cannot tell the difference between platonic and romantic feelings. <laughs> Sometimes, you know, you have to learn sometime. You have to learn sometime. And you know what? You're not born with that knowledge. <laughs> Sometimes it's hard to tell. Um, <laughs> let's do, let's do too young for kissing. Let's do too young for kissing. I think <laughs> it's okay, Tegan. I have a hard time with that too. <laughs> she's going to be so fucking evil when she's a young adult. She's going to be crushing hearts. Absolutely. Because she has to do the, um, the villainous Valentine, um, uh, aspiration, which is going to be real fun. <laughs> I'm excited for her future. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. Uh, let's fast forward because we're not worried about this right now. Tegan is totally a lesbian. And I have a reason for that. Okay. Not only from the everything about her and the fact that she probably wore Bermuda shorts and she's a warrior cat kid and all of the above. Um, and also, her only friend currently at this moment, who is a boy, is her father and a 600-year-old vampire. Um, <laughs> I don't want to worry about um, Tegan accidentally getting pregnant if she has some of these, um, these aspirations that she completes, because there's one that's a serial romantic, and I don't have to worry about a child. <laughs> Because I personally don't want Tegan to have to be a parent yet, you know? So that's not going to happen for a long time. And then eventually we will adopt a child down the line is the plan. So that's why I'm making her a lesbian. Canonically. <laughs> but also, the everything about her should have given it away. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Oh, nice. You got 69k channel points. Hell yeah. Tegan and Sarah. <laughs> Uh-huh. Yep, that makes sense. That makes sense. <laughs> oh goodness. What's oh, what's the only thing worse than a rape than a rapist? Boom, a child. No. <laughs> oh gosh, that's that's me in this game cuz I don't want to take care of a toddler again. I'm sorry. The toddlers are cute and all. I don't enjoy taking care of them. If I could uninstall parenthood, I would consider it. <laughs> If I could toggle it on and off so I could only take care of toddlers when I want to take care of toddlers, I would do that. <laughs> I would absolutely do that. Oh my goodness. All right, let me fast forward here. We don't need any of this. Why are you just sitting in the dark? I thought we turned... I thought I just paid the bills. Oh no, I didn't pay the bills. I lied. The bills did not get paid. Pay the bills. I love how we we can't use our phone because we don't have... Oh, we can. Why is it we can only... Oh, okay. Okay. There's only certain things you can do when your power is shut off, and one of them is pay your bills. <laughs> and quit your job. You can't find a job when your power is out. Oh no, can't do that. Of course not. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna turn that off. I'm gonna turn that off. Okay, okay. And like that... <laughs> and like that, we don't have a lot of money anymore. Don't have a lot of money anymore. You know what? And that's life. That. <laughs> no lie, I want to boot up Sims 4 right now and make a smaller house for you. I Listen, I'm very excited. If you want to make a shell, actually, actually, if you want to make a shell, I would consider that. I like to decorate the insides. I don't so much enjoy the outsides all the time. Uh, of, of That sounded like a weird sentence. 
I don't enjoy making the exterior of the houses very often. Um, so if you want to go make a shell for me to fill, we could do that if you guys want to do a shell challenge. I don't know. I could fill up all of those houses. We could just make new crest, which we haven't touched at all in this in this save yet. We could just fill that up with community builds. So if you guys have things that you want to do in The Sims 4 and you want to put it in this game, yeah, absolutely. We could totally do that. And then I could just spend my time doing the things that I like doing, which is the interiors. And then also, I also enjoy sometimes adding in, like, um, I don't like building the house, but I like doing the landscaping. You know what I mean? Like, I like adding a bunch of flowers and making it look a little pretty on the outside. But also, I don't want to mess with building the actual structure of the house. You know? You know what I mean? Anyway, my opinion. All right. <laughs> <laughs> We've been, you're just standing there. You've just been standing there all day, Aaliyah. My dear, what are we doing? What are we, you know what we could do? We could get rid of this. We could get rid of this $12,000 purchase. We could get rid of the thing that costs 12,000 simoleons that we put in our backyard. I bet it's not worth that much anymore because the value decreases. But um, let's just see. Oh, it's 4,000 now. Hang on, how much was it originally? Okay, it wasn't 12,000. Okay, it was 5,000 simoleons. So we could sell that right now. But she's still a child and can use it. So I don't want to sell it until she's an adult. <laughs> um, do I want multiple floors or just one floor? Um, good question. I don't know. I want a basement, though. <laughs> I need a basement and a big yard. That's the only thing I can think of right now that I want. <laughs> um... I don't know. I I don't know. You you could just just do what you think looks nice, and then I will I will see if I like it. Tegan's totally having a teenager's basement. Oh yeah, I think that sounds good. But also, when Tegan transitions to being an adult, I want her to have a basement so that she could work on like you know science projects and other terrifying things. You know you know what I mean. She needs a creepy basement as well. <laughs> That's my opinion. Yeah, I uh, I really like this house a lot, but the person that I built this house for was a painter. And in The Sims, that's one of the most lucrative jobs because it's fast and easy, you know, because you can make as many... Um, if you level up your painting skills to 10, then you're selling paintings that take you a few hours to make and you're selling them for thousands of simoleons at a time. So they could afford this big house. They could also afford many trips to Salvadora, etc., etc. So this family is not them. They don't have that kind of money right now. They're working on it. They're working on it. And Tegan is going to be rich one day because she has to for that aspiration. Um, but at the moment, no, not at, not at this moment. All right, let's see what we're doing. I don't know that we can craft any emotional potions yet because she's not got the skill level for it, which is a pain in the butt. What's What level do you get that? I'm going to have her go experiment for a little bit and maybe start a fire. I shouldn't have said that because last time I said, I hope this doesn't start a fire, we had a big fire. <laughs> ah, Sims, where you can live the dream of being an artist. True, an artist that is well paid and rich. Mm hmm. Yep. What a world. What a world. All right, I'm going to look this up really quick on my phone. Um, um, child mental aspiration, Sims 4. I can spell aspiration. Sims All right. I'm gonna have her work on her skills while I look this up. Lifestyle gain. Miles is an indoorsy person now. Okay, good to know. Good to know. All right. Okay, how do I do the emotional potions? It requires a mental skill level of seven. Okay, good to know. So we're almost there. We are almost there. Who is here? Why do we have a child outside our... Who are you? Oh, are you Miki's brother? Hello? A child. <laughs> Just standing outside of our house? All right. Okay. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. Um, Miles, I don't know what you want to do. I'm not focusing on you right now. We're only focusing on Tegan. Child spotted. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. <laughs> Um, should we add? Yeah, absolutely, Miki. Come on over. Pull through. Should we add? She did meet someone at school today, but it was Alexander Goth, who is not a a, a girl. 
<laughs> and I don't know if we're keeping. Oh, I need to change the name of T Gang. Hang on. Um, let me do that really quick. As you guys voted, and I am fair. You cannot call me unfair, T Gang. Oh <laughs> uh, man, um, should we add? Should we add Alexander Goth? He's rich, so maybe we have you know like a, an investor now. You know, and his, whenever his parents die, he will have lots of money. Have you seen their house? Have you seen their house? Hello? <laughs> Get the chopper for a child spotted. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, we could add Alexander Goth. I would consider that. Sugar daddy with no sugar. Absolutely. You know, I think that's a good pick. I think that's a good pick for our squad. This is good. We're making friends and influencing people. And every time I add them to the group, I forget to switch this back over. It's fine. We're fine. We're just gonna go to the park at some point and just have Tegan go around and introduce herself. She'll just go around and say, Hi, my name is Tegan Beckett. I'm gonna be the president one day. Make friends with me now. What can you offer me? <laughs> That's just what she's gonna do. That's what she's gonna do, you know? Oh, as soon as we get this up. As soon as we get this going, I think we will do that. Oh, Miggy's coming out! Look at this! Stop, this is so cute. They're discussing their world domination plans. Giving Lily Scout energy? <laughs> she is, she would be a Lily Scout. I, I approve of that. For those of you who don't know, Lily Scout is um, technically the name of my D&D &D character that I am playing in uh, one of my friend's campaigns. Um, her name is Lilliput Scout. She's a gnome. I think I talked about this last stream. Um, but she's basically a Girl Scout, and I love her to bits. And she wants to earn all the badges that she's making herself. And she's going to, um, she's doing the best. And I love her, and she's wonderful. Um, hell yes! Okay, we got that far. This is good. Um, Tegan, you need to go, oof, you need to deal with all of these things. I hate not being able to cheat right now. <laughs> Oh dear. Right, I just busted into an empty lot. Time to build the Beckett's a more sustainable house. This is good. We need this. We need this. Going from Sims 3 to Sims 4 UI is interesting. <laughs> we do stand Lily. We do stand Lily. I love her very much. Um, why don't, real quick, why don't you do a health potion so you can get your hunger up and your mental skill level up? Then we'll send you straight to bed. Straight to bed. No, actually, you have to drink the potion first. Never mind. We can't send you straight to bed. We cannot do that. This is fine. Okay, let's stave off home. She is only... She has only, um... Consumed her own health potions recently. She has not had real food. So we've gone from having... Hog shits that are, like... Solid rocks. <laughs> to now a completely liquid diet. So this is fun. Oh dear, okay. Lily and her guard dad, Steve. Yeah, we have, so, when, uh, so Ollie, Ollie Ollie Oxenfree, is playing a, oh shoot, what is your, are you, a, you're not a barbarian. What is your, wait, what is Steve's class? The, the idea is that he's Steve Harrington from Stranger Things, but it's not Steve Harrington, it's Steve Garrington. But I'm- he is a barbarian. Okay, alright. I don't know why I thought he wasn't, but yeah. He's a barbarian, and, and Lily is 100% going to be on his shoulders for piggyback rides for a lot of the campaign. She may fight that way, honestly. She may fight that way. I'm looking forward to it, because I love a cleric-barbarian um, relationship, friend relationship, because of Grog and Pike from Vox Machina, or The Legend of Vox Machina, I guess I would say now, instead of just Critical Role. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay, Tegan, have you slept enough? You've slept enough. Go get a shower, but not in there. Go get a shower over there. It is a good dynamic. It brings me a lot of joy, honestly. It makes me very happy. It makes me very happy, you know? Yeah. I love Dungeons and Dragons very much. <laughs> Alrighty. You know what I really want to do? You know what we're going to do, actually? Um, you're not going to school today, Tegan. You have other shit to do. I'm sorry. You're too smart for school. How do I? There we go. Take a vacation day. Take a vacation day before you take a pog shit, because otherwise you will still go to school and they'll be messed up. <laughs> I love my tiny wizard and her even tinier weasel. 
I love her too. I love how Tegan can call herself out of school. She doesn't have to ask her parents or anything. She just calls herself out. It's fine. Um, we're going to do those emotion potions and then very close to achieving one of our others, uh, our other aspirations, which is good. Um, not worrying about all these guys. We've got one emotion potion. Done. Emotion potion. What's your... They want to remember Schoolhouse Rock. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah. Yeah. You know, my mom, when we were a kid, when, when me and my siblings were, was, when we were young, I can speak. I promise you I can speak. When we were young, she and my dad used to like sing random things or say like random like pulls from quotes and things from movies and stuff and they would always as soon as they were finished they would go obscure reference and we would be like i don't know what that means but okay so we just start repeating things that they would say we didn't know where they were from they were just an obscure reference and if i had a kid my kid would be so damn confused my kid would be so confused with all of the weird shit that i say on a daily basis okay my child would be, oh, this is why I don't have kids, because they would just be spouting Vine references and weird TikTok audios, and they wouldn't know what they were saying, but they'd be saying it. They're like, yeah, this is fun. And people are like, do you, do you know what that means? And they'd be like, nope, it's an obscure reference. Mm -hmm. And it's not pronounced obscure, it's obscure. <laughs> it's, a, it's a very minute little difference in there. <laughs> um... We always keep them accurate. We always keep them accurate around here. Um, I think what we're going to do with Tegan today is Tegan's going to go to the park and she's going to make some friends. We're going to do that real quick. Um, she also has a badge to collect, which is good. We have two badges to collect. Fuck yeah! Let's go. Let's go. Tegan is so smart. I love her so much. She's been promoted to Unicorn Scout. I'm so proud of her. <gasps> She has a good repu- good reputation? Hello? Oh my gosh, I'm so proud of her. I'm so proud of her. All right, we are gonna go introduce ourselves to people at the park. We're gonna go do that. We're gonna go travel and introduce ourselves. Should we do it at the park or just random people on the street? I feel like the park would be easier, but she could just go up to this random kid over here. Why are all these children walking around? It is school time. Have you all skipped school? Alexander Goth is skipping school. Horrible. All right, let's go interview this kid and see if he's up to uh, up to the task of being in the T gang. And the other computer broke again. That's fun. <laughs> All right, I'm on the right spot, right? I am. Yes. Okay. We've met three new Sims. All right. Screw you. We don't want to talk to you anymore. Bye. Bye! Let's go talk to someone else. Hey, you! Hey, lady! Let's go talk to a random person on the street. Like, hey, excuse me, I'm selling cookies for a dollar a box. Would you like some? Sure, yeah, what flavors you got? Alright, does that count? We've met four sims! Perfect! Let's go talk to Jeffrey Landgrab, class trader. Just kidding, I don't know what he uh, I don't care for the land grabs, you know? I genuinely don't. I'm like, you know, he's technically a good sim, but also his name is Land Grab, as in Land Grab Power Company, so I don't trust him. He turns off my power. I don't trust him. All right, okay, boom. Just like that. Just like that, we have, we have zoomed forward in this. Come friends with three other children. Oh dear, it has to be children, huh? It can't be Vlad, huh? That's fun. All right, this is fine. This is fine. We're doing great. Okay. Um, now with a name like that, nope. I love the title of the stream. I can tell you put a a lot a lump sim of thought into it. Gosh, they'll be capitalists. Hello, ZWH. Hello and welcome. How are you doing? 
How are you doing, dear? How are things going? Tell me all about it. It's so good to see you. <laughs> um, I've gotten lost. Where's our home? Oh, it's over here. We're fine. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna send her. Oh, look, Miki is here. This is perfect timing. You also skipped school. Look at all these people that skipped school today. It was, it was, it must have been a skip day. Must have been a day where everyone said, we're going to ditch. We're going to ditch today. That's what's going to happen. Sun boy is spotted. I'm doing, I'm doing great. Working on some disgustingly beautiful 80s counters. Oh, for The Sims 4? I'm assuming that's what this is for. I'm assuming that's what this is for. Um, oh gosh, what is going on in this household? You got to repair that. You got to flush. Everything is broken. Everything is broken in this house. What happened here? What happened? I'm so confused. There are three things broken in this house right now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh gosh, yes for the Sims. Okay, good. That's awesome. I'm excited to see what happens with that. I will keep an eye out for when you release that. You downloaded Frog- Wait, didn't I download Froggy Chair? I swear to God I downloaded Froggy Chair. Hang on. Froggy Chair? Froggy chair? I swear to god I downloaded things. Hang on. Hang on. This is very important. I knew I was gonna do this and then I knew I was gonna forget about it. Custom content only right now. Why are you showing me everything? I'll click that. It's fine. I only want custom content. Why are you showing me not custom? Oh, I need to hide Maxis. Hang on. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. We've got that. Where's the chair? Who got bonked? <laughs> We're getting bonked. It's not named Froggy Chair. It's named the Kinder Maid Chair. <gasps> Stop! Are you seeing this? Oh my god. I love this so much. I was gonna put it in Tegan's room, but now I just kind of want to put it everywhere. Hang on. Hang on. This is the most incredible thing. Do you- are you guys seeing this? Are you seeing this? Hello? It has different colors. This is gonna be what Tegan uses when she calls a meeting of the tea gang. Everyone's gonna sit around the table in these specific chairs. Oh my gosh. What color should Tegan be? What color should Tegan have? Green? This is incredible. I'm so happy right now. I'm so happy. Look at this. Oh my god. I love this so much. I want 10 of these. Hello? I love them so much. I'm seeing it. I'm seeing all the horrible imperfections. Oh gosh, I don't see any imperfections. I think they're perfect and I love them so much. They make me so happy right now. Oh my goodness. It functions as a dining chair. I love it! This is amazing! We should just replace their dining chairs right now! Oh my gosh, I'm keeping them right there. They're all gonna be right there. I'm leaving them like that. I don't care how it looks. I love it. <laughs> you wanna see how the front porch works? Okay. Um, it's not really anything too special. You mean this one? Is this what you're talking about, Scotty? It doesn't have to be exactly this. Like, I don't... I don't think I want to keep it in this this style. I think I'm good with making it look completely different. So we don't we do not need to do match this style. We we're probably gonna make a move, you know. <laughs> so you can do whatever you want. Go off, you know. Go off. All right. I am so happy that I have this now. I meant to download the streamer pack, but I don't think I did. Um, I'll have to work on that another time. But yeah, I love them so much. I love the froggy chairs. You've done a smaller a smaller floor plan. Okay, cool. Very cool. You did? Oh, you, I did. Hang on. Important. I need to. I need to. I need to look at this. Um, content. Okay, it's all the same. This is the streamer pack. Okay. Okay. Hang on. Show me all. Is that everything? I feel like I'm missing things. Hang on. Hang on. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. I've downloaded several things from you. I love this speaker, by the way, too. Look at that size. Look how cute that is. 
I love it. I have not explored this. I kind of downloaded it and then I forgot about it. Gamer juice cans! <gasps> I'm putting those in Tegan's room right now. Right at this moment. Gamer, gamer juice cans! Stop, I love it. Oh my goodness. This is wonderful. Oh, head headphones, we need those. Gotta have those. This is very cool. This is very cool. And a ring what? I should have explored this earlier, but I'm an idiot. These are so cool! <gasps> Stop. I could make my room. I have a ring like right now. Goodness. I'm gonna play around with this very, very soon. I haven't been I've been really busy these like past couple of days for some reason. So like I haven't had a chance to just play The Sims, which is annoying because I had several builds that I wanted to work on for a couple of build challenges, but like I love it. <laughs> I don't know if you're a Jenna Marbles fan, but you should read the name and description of the green screen. I am 100 percent a Jenna Marbles fan. Hello? Hello? Where is the green screen? I gotta find it. Hang <laughs> I'm having me time. Get out. <laughs> I'm oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We all love Jenna Marbles here. Absolutely. I adore this. I adore this. Hilarious. I love it so much. Why are you so funny? Hello? <laughs> I'm so excited to play around with that because I want to do a streamer room real bad. Feel free to change any part of this layout. I'm just bullshitting right now. Good to know. Good to know. Okay, wait, where are you going? Mika, wait. Where are you going? Can't we, like, where's the best, best BFF friend thing that I can do? The best, best BFF friend thing. <laughs> the, the BBBFFF. <laughs> it's what I just said. You know, I don't have a singular thought in my head when I stream, and I need you all to know that. I think you probably already know that from the everything about me, but in case you didn't know, now you know. Now you know. Um, how close are we to becoming best friends? Why cannot we just immediately become best friends? Ask to cloud gaze. There we go. That'll, that'll do it. That's how I did it in the olden days, actually, was I didn't really know a lot about The Sims, and so I wanted Sims to become friends faster so I could get them to be married, so I just had them sit around all day in cloud gaze. Oh dear. Oh dear. Should should Aaliyah banish the self-abuse and admit that she dislikes handiness? But Aaliyah, we need you! You're the only handy one here! Oh gosh, alright, okay. Alright, you can dislike it, that's fine. <laughs> It was another streamer's idea. I can only take credit for the description. LOL. It was her idea for the name. I think that's hilarious. And props to both you and the streamer because it's wonderful and I adore it. I think it's fantastic. Um, pe do people not actually become best friends literally the instant they meet? <laughs> oh, that was a that was an ill-timed bomb, Casey. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're bonking about now. Aaliyah is a pillow princess confirmed. <laughs> good for her. Honestly, good for her, though. Honestly, good for her. Okay, guys, can you go here and cloud gaze or something? I need you to be best friends now. I need you to be best friends yesterday. <laughs> um, There's a way to do it. How can I, how can I cloud gaze? There's a way to do it. To cloud gaze. All right, go do it. Listen to what I'm saying and do it. Hello? Alright. Perfect. Perfect. I think this increases your social skill too? Question? No, it doesn't. It doesn't. That's fine. We're just gonna have them sit there for a while and gain friendship skills. This is life hacks for the Sims. We've just become good friends. It's working. It's working. Oh man. Okay. Fast forward, you, you totally just stepped on that child's face. You know, I wish there was an option in The Sims to go back in time. <laughs> just to re rewind for a few seconds, just to see what you just saw again. You know what I mean? I think that'd be funny. I don't know if it's just me or not. 
I like collaborating with Sims player for Sims stuff, like for names and things. So I think everything I've released, or almost everything, has been in collaboration with Sims streamers. I'm not sure if I said this, but I have a huge 200 plus item pack planned with just ideas from the community. <gasps> I'm so excited for that. I cannot wait to download that. <laughs> <laughs> I sneak into streams and ask what streamers want in the game and then tell them what I'm doing. That's a, honestly, that's a brilliant way of like marketing yourself to be incredibly honest. Just being like, you know, you're finding, first of all, you're finding your market, you're finding your niche, you know, and then selling it to them in their chat. And then they could potentially like use it like I'm using it in the game. And then more people see it who are watching The Sims. It's a brilliant marketing strategy. Yeah. It makes a lot of sense. CWH has big brain. Confirmed. Confirmed. That's what I have to say about that. <laughs> um, oh, you're hungry again. Why don't you make another potion? <laughs> um, let's do that real quick. Yeah, you don't need you don't need food right now. You can survive on potions alone. This is fine. <laughs> oh man. I could have you eat a single tomato. I feel like Tegan eats like a neurodivergent individual. You know what I mean? Do you know what I mean by that? Oh shit, I hit the wrong one. I just hit an emotion potion and I don't know what emotion that was. That was the wrong potion. What's that gonna do? Hello? Maybe the emotion potion didn't work? Oh no, it just made her need to poop real bad. Oh, it made her need to poop real bad. Oh no, it made her need to poop real bad. <laughs> oh dear, I've marketed my stuff entirely from Twitch by asking what they wanted in a streamer pack just because that was the first thing I ever released. Oh, very smart. Just feed the child. <laughs> I give her food. I say, having only consumed cereal and cheese and crackers today. This is what I mean when I say that she eats like a neurodivergent person. You know what I mean? You know what I mean when I say that? It means she'll eat what she eats. And she might not because she'll forget about it. You know? And that's okay. It's okay. She will eat when she eats. <laughs> um, an apple. There you go. We could eat those things and she'll be fine. She'll be fine. Yeah, don't let them tell you how to control your life. They don't. They don't need to worry. You know what? She is good on her own. She's doing great. Look at that full hunger bar. She's doing great. She's doing just great. Alright, oh, I should make sure... I don't think I need to be on for that to go through, but... I just realized I did not I did not say a complete sentence right there. Alright, y'all. We're in- we are in the doldrums of this aspiration challenge. We just need to get through some of this stuff. Oh, gosh. I'm really looking forward to her being a teenager. I really want her to do that. I think it, someone will have to correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that we might not need to worry about the badges, getting all the badges as a child, because I think you can be a scout as a teenager. So that would be good if we could just finish these aspirations and then move on from being a child because it's, it's boring and we're ready to move into the drama of this actual challenge. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I think that would be a good plan. I think we're gonna do that. <laughs> New house is going well. Thanks for letting me scratch this itch. Absolutely, absolutely. I have seen several streamers that have done like build challenges or like shell challenges where like they will let people um, make houses with a specific tag and then they will show them off on stream with like tours and house tours and stuff. And I think it's a great idea and I would love to do that if more people that watch me played The Sims and wanted to build. You know what I mean? Because some people are not interested in building at all. It's not their thing. They don't want to do it. You know, I've said, you know, a thousand times in the past 10 minutes. So I hope you know. <laughs> oh, dear. All right. Go to bed, Tegan. And another thing broke. Hey, Scotty, when designing the new house, um, when I'm filling the inside, remind me not to put random electronics everywhere. Just remind me to do that. You know, I, cause I clearly forgot when I was making this house cause I put electronics everywhere and it was a mistake. <laughs> I'd love to play more Sims. My laptop on the other hand, understandable. I played the Sims on my Mac for several years. And my poor Mac did her best. She did her best. She tried so hard, but she was not cut out for that. It was not what she was made for. You know what I mean? 
Hey, Liz, babes, don't put random electronics everywhere. XOXO. Hey, Scotty, thanks so much for that extremely helpful advice. I really appreciate it. <laughs> uh, remember when I wanted to build that house in The Sims and then Sims broke, so I built it in Minecraft instead? I do remember that. And it looked very good in Minecraft. I miss playing Minecraft. I have not had the urge to play Minecraft in probably a few weeks. Um, it's probably been like three or four weeks maybe and like I had some like uh words are hard I had some TikToks pop up of people showing off things to do in Minecraft or builds and things I was like oh oh no I'm about to get I'm about to get sucked back into this it's only been a few weeks but I'm about to get sucked back into oh, playing yeah. Minecraft <laughs> Oh dear. I'm saving up for a PC so I can actually have The Sims and Blender open at the same time without my computer perishing. That's a great, that's a great idea. That is a great idea. I wish that I could give everyone in my chat a nice beefy laptop or gaming computer so that we could all play games together. But I don't have that kind of money. <laughs> uh, she barely likes big Minecraft textures. Packs, understandable. Understandable. Casey, what does that mean? I need to build hot foot in our realm? Casey, I... Casey, what does that mean? Casey? Casey? What, is that... what does that mean? Hello? <laughs> the hot foot challenge? From... From Achievement Hunter? Hot foot is a game? Okay, I did not... I did not know this. Is this like... Is this like... The floor is lava? Is that what we're talking about right now? Hot foot? They're the same. <laughs> Scotty gets me. They're the same flavor of nerd as me. <laughs> I love that we have brought you two together to be achievement hunter nerds in my chat. I don't understand what's going on though. See, and ZWH doesn't either, so I am not alone here. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, so it's basically the floor is lava. So it's like a parkour course? Is that what we're talking about? Oh gosh, the more we talk about this, the more I want to start playing, like, Bed Wars right now. <laughs> I think I might play Bed Wars later tonight. I'm not joking you. Just talking about Minecraft is making me want to play it right now. <laughs> uh, okay, so it's not the floor is lava. It's not parkour. I'm gonna need you to explain. Scotty or Casey, at any point, if you want to explain, that would be great. Because I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh dear. Is it like Spleef? Oh, also, Blender is a 3D software. I'm not talking about the kitchen appliance, if you didn't know. Mm -hmm. Good to know. Good to know. For for anyone who didn't know in the chat, that's what Blender means. There. <laughs> kind of like Spleef, less PvP, more luck. Okay. It's a platform made of sand, and there's wood underneath, and you light the wood on fire and dance around on the sand till it falls underneath you. You light the wood on fire and dance around... I'm an, I am a visual, visual individual, I'm a visual learner, I'm a need, like a dyslexic version of a TNT run, I don't understand what's going on, um, so I'm a need a visual explanation of it, <laughs> um, the wood will burn away and the sand will fall, okay, the sand is above you or below you, it's a platform made of sand and there's wood underneath, and you light the wood on fire and dance around on the sand until it falls underneath you. Who lights the wood? One layer wood, one layer sand. When the wood burns away, the sand drops. Okay. So it's like that game that we that we used to play where it was like, it was ice, right? And it was the little like plastic ice cubes. And you knocked out one by one and then you had to make the other person fall. Is that what it is? Either the game master or you can redstone it. Okay. All right. Okay. The horse's name was Wednesday. Who's on first? What's on second? I don't know. Third base. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, I don't know what's going on right now. And that's okay. That's okay. Um, I'm speaking I'm speaking gibberish. We need an alert for that math gift. Somebody write that down because I won't remember. But yes, we do need that. Alright. Um enthuse about candy. Isn't candy good? Every interaction that Tegan has, I feel like is, even though she is a child, it feels like, how do you do, fellow kids? <laughs> how big do I want the basement? 
Um, great question. How I don't know how big the house is. I don't know enough to fit at least twelve children. <laughs> oh yeah, all the all the children that Tegan will um adopt. <laughs> Cursed content, ZWH. Thank you. Oh goodness, there are so many things in the sim. I'm not gonna do that. Sorry, I got distracted. Um, there are so many um examples of Sims players playing God and being so mean to their Sims. The amount of like creepy basements there are on the gallery of like places to keep Sims while they slave away making paintings for you to sell so you could be super rich. There's too many of them. There's too many of them, you guys. We are too mean to our Sims, and if our Sims ever became conscious and came after us they would remember it they would remember every single time you took the pool ladder away from them and they would get revenge that's what i think you have to be nice to your sims that's my opinion i watched chernobyl yesterday and i'm still traumatized it sounds like a very sad um uh story i i assume it's a very sad tv show because i i know that the history is very sad so, I am assuming it's a documentation, doc, doc, documentary. <laughs> you know how in The Wizard of Oz they say words that are kind of what they mean, but not quite? <laughs> That's what I mean when I say documentation and mean documentary. <laughs> Gosh, is it, is it, okay, it's a historical fiction miniseries. Okay, okay, good to know. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> if they be, if the Sims became alive, just put a plate in front of them and they won't be able to move. That's a deep cut. <laughs> That's so mean. You're right. You're not wrong. You are not wrong. Wait, did I just see, okay, I don't care about this, Aaliyah. You do whatever you want. Did I just see become partners in crime? pause did i see it did i see them have that choice and i skipped past yes become partners in crime crime baby has made her lieutenant she's got her lieutenant she knows she knows who her who her squad is are we best friends yet hello are we best friends yet reveal deep secret can we be best friends is that what we are now gosh oh this is taking forever i regret everything <laughs> Oh dear. Okay. Did we just become best friends? <laughs> I wish that's how it worked here. Okay, basement havers. Are your stairs internal or external? Scotty? You mean like inside the house or outside of the house? Is that what you mean by that? England doesn't tend to have basements unless in pubs. Okay. Most have both. Okay, for if you're talking about like in the suburbs or in most houses outside of like the cities in America, it's going to be internal. If you're talking about like um like in the cities, they will have I guess in some cases basements that will go outside because you know that it like layers. Um I don't know, I've seen a few of those, but for the most part it's internal. For the most part it's internal. I would say if it has external stairs, it's a creepy basement. <laughs> it's a creepy basement if it has external stairs. Oh dear. All right, are they best friends yet? They've been talking about fractions and revealing deep secrets for forever. Plan to start a food fight. This is good. This is good. Wait, did I just see it? Did I see it and I missed it? Ha ha! Become best friends forever. Become best, best, best friends forever friends. All right, we've got it. Don't, don't do that. Oh, plan to start a food fight. Okay, good, good, good. Perfect. Oh, that took a while. Okay, we've re reached social level nine. This is good. This is good. Um, external lends itself into more cellar territory, and that's creepy. Yeah, there you go. That's what I mean. Cellars are creepy. Cellars are creepy, where you keep creepy things. <laughs> also, my brain malfunctioned and wouldn't let me spell territory. You know, 
I think I'm also having a brain mal malfunction today. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is, but it's just the case. All right, we're going to summon the squad, I think. We don't have that many children around. Maybe we need to add one more child to this to this group. We only know we only know one more child. Hang on. Um, yep, we only know one child. This is fine. Tain Nagata. We want to add him, I guess. We need one more child to be friends with. We can kick him later if he's not worthy. We're gonna start a gathering. Um, we're gonna have them just focus on being social to one another because that's what we need to focus on right now. <laughs> one more child to the basement? No, no, not to the basement. Not to the basement. <laughs> Tegan, Miki, Alex, and Vlad. <laughs> Tegan, Miki, Alex, Tane, and Vlad. All right, we're gonna start a gathering. Should we have their gathering be in some like secret place? Hang on. Hang on. Let's choose somewhere fun. Let's choose somewhere real fun. Um. <laughs> what if we sent them to... What about... <laughs> sent them to the magic realm. <laughs> Should their meeting place be in the magic realm? It's so hard to get to. Hang on. Um... We can either send them and have them be in the magic realm, or we can have them be at ancient ruins. I feel like meeting at the ancient ruins is a good spot. I'm gonna put froggy chairs in there. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do that. We're gonna travel, gather at the ancient ruins, and we're gonna put froggy chairs there. This is a good choice. I will not bully your shell, Scotty. Absolutely not. I will not bully. I would never. I would never. Their meeting place is just the literal upside down. Oh, this is good. This is good. In the middle of a thunderstorm. And I've sent them to a place that has no building. Oh my goodness. This is good. This is good. Um. <laughs> yeah, we are going to end stream a bit early tonight. I know that for a fact. We're going to be ending stream in about 15 minutes. Um, because I am prioritizing friendships and making sure that I make time for friends um so <laughs> so yeah we, this will probably be one of the last things we do before we wrap up here oh boy this does seem like the primal pa primal place for the summing of something we should I want to light this but I don't know if I can light it in a fire where I don't know where you're running to because there is no structure here for you guys to run to there is nothing right now. I don't know where Tegan is running to. We've sent her to some place in the middle of a storm. Where is she running to? Hello? Oh gosh, okay. Is this safe enough for you? All right, we need the froggy chairs, hang on. Um, What is the froggy chair called? Do we remember? Hang on. Bushy on X Games mode. All right. This is good. This is real good. We have five individuals, right? I'm going to change those colors in a second. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. I need a dining table. Let's do, I think, surfaces, table, that back. All right, this is good. This is important and necessary for our game. Um, yeah. Let's do, no, let's do something fancy. This is perfect. This is perfect. Let me add, make sure all of those are on there properly. I am so thrilled about this. This is perfect. I'm so thrilled. Okay, got green. We're gonna need one that's pink, I think. Yellow, orange and light blue let's do that it's perfect it's perfect there is one more swatch so we could have one more we could put one more down and save it for i don't know <laughs> this is good this is perfect i think i think we've done a great job here um all right everybody take your places at the table <laughs> sit together Oh 
my gosh. All right, we just need all of them to get over here. Oh, Vlad teleported. This is good. This is real good. I'm so happy with what's happening here. Hang on, I am going to delete this chair for right now. Just for right now. My game is getting real slow for some reason. All right, we're just missing Miki. No, guys, don't move. This is not good. We're just missing Miki. Okay, this is perfect. This, these are all the swatches that are in Animal Crossing as well. Perfect. Perfect. Great work, everybody. Okay, we've called this meeting. <laughs> we've called this meeting today of the tea gang. And we are here to talk about very important things. <laughs> this is so important. All right. The important thing that we're trying to do is um, become friends with all of you. So let's talk in the middle of this thunderstorm. Let's talk about grilled cheese. Let's share brilliant ideas. Let's talk about how we're going to rule the world as the thunderstorm rages around us. <laughs> this is good. This is real important. <laughs> oh dear. All right. <laughs> This is so ridiculous of Vlad just being there. This is a scout meeting. Oh god. Oh no! There was a lightning strike. Okay, maybe we should disband this meeting. This is not what I expected when we did this. Alright, end the gathering. Everyone go home. This has been a very productive tea party. Thanks everybody. We'll see you next time. <laughs> Tegan choosing the meeting place, so we have chosen death. <laughs> okay, we're gonna send Tegan home. She doesn't deserve to be terrified. Oh dear god, okay. <laughs> this is good, this is good. We're just gonna send her home, she'll be safe. We don't need Tegan dying or anything like that, even though I don't think children can die except for or I think we said before, heat and freezing. So she'd be fine. Vlad might be in a little bit of danger. I just realized we definitely took Vlad to some place that was in the daylight. So we could have just killed Vlad because there was no place to hide from the sun there. This is good. This is good. Heat, freezing, and poison from pufferfish. Oh, I didn't know that. BWH, you know so many things. This is important. I need this around. Okay, everybody. Oh, we knew the social one was going to take a long time. We've gotten pretty far here. We've, we're level eight with that. Okay, Vlad should probably unalive anyway. <laughs> I think we could work on that. I think we could work on Tegan, Tegan, Tegan uh, dethroning him once she's learned everything she needs to when she's working on the, va the vampire aspirations. <laughs> what can I say? I have like 8k hours in this game. Oh my lord, that's so many. I do not have that many. I have several hours in this game, but not that many. That is so impressive. He invaded my apartment once and I've never forgiven him. You shouldn't forgive him. You shouldn't forgive him. He's not supposed to be the good vampires. The good vampires in this game are supposed to be, I think Caleb and Lilith uh, Vittore. They're supposed to be like the good vampires and he's supposed to be the evil one. So Tegan's probably gonna kill him. We'll see about that. That's a later problem. That is a later problem. <laughs> I'm including CC making as hours in the game. I only have about 6k registered hours. But I spend about 40 hours a week making CC. I think that counts. I think that counts. That counts a lot. I just realized we didn't save once this entire time. We're living on the edge here. I'm going to save twice. Even though it just saved, I save it again. Just in case. All right, everybody, let me get my uh, live cam, my just chatting scene back up. Everybody, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for being here at this very, very short, very chill little sim stream. Hopefully we'll do this again very soon. I am so tempted to cheat. <laughs> I'm so tempted to both cheat and I'm so tempted to just like 
do this off screen to get it done just so we can finish this part and move on to the interesting things. Um, hopefully the next time we do a sim stream, maybe we'll be building something. Maybe we'll be filling up that shell that Scotty has been making. So I think that might be a fun, fun thing to do next stream. I really wanted to get her to be a teenager this stream, but that didn't happen. So that's fine. We'll get there eventually. I knew what I was signing up for when I started this challenge. It's okay. I knew it. I expected this. It's what's, it's what's gotta happen, you know? It's what's gotta happen, and that's okay. Um, yeah, living life dangerously, absolutely. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, um, the next time that I will be streaming will be Sunday, actually. We're going to be doing a Genshin Impact stream, so that'll be very fun and hopefully very relaxing. I um I enjoy Genshin Impact a lot actually. I find it very soothing. I think that the music and I think that the the way that that the visuals are in the game is very pretty and very easy on the eyes. So I'm looking forward to that. I think that we're probably going to do I want to do like an explanation beforehand, like explaining the game so far for anyone who hasn't played or know anything about Genshin Impact. So that is the plan right now. Um, and then, um, I think the week after that, um, we might have some, some dream daddies, actually, in honor of Valentine's Day. We might be doing some dream daddies. I have a feeling it's going to take me more than one stream to get through, um, and I will not be streaming, actually, on Valentine's Day, because I will be off from the 18th, from the 11th to the 18th. Um, so we will miss Valentine's Day proper, but we could do some celebrating beforehand. So I'm really looking forward to that. Um, do we want to raid someone? Do we want to raid someone to see if anyone is live? Do we, do we see anyone who is live right now? Is, is Maddie supposed to go live today? Does anyone know? Does anyone know? I want to go check really, really quick. I would love to raid someone. It's one of my favorite things to do. Um, let's get the raid messages in chat as well. So we have that for those who are not subscribed. And we have our sub, I believe, for those who are subscribed. Maddie and Jer are both live, I believe. Okay, good to know, good to know. Let me save and exit out of my Sims game real quick. Maddie and Jer are both live. Oh, I see Jermith is live. Okay, I am seeing that now. I don't see Maddie. I guess it's not showing me right now. Oh, I see. Now I see. Yeah, why don't we raid Maddie? Oh gosh, that sounds like so much fun. Let's raid Maddie. Let's do that. Um, let me do raid Maddie monster. Um, and then we will head on over there. Guys, once again, thank you so much for a wonderful stream. I had a very fun time. The more that we do this, the more chill it makes me feel. And the more I get like just excited to hang out with you guys and say hello for a little bit. So thank you so much for being here. I really do appreciate it. Every single view, lurk, everything, chat, being here just makes me so happy. It helps so much more than you know. Um, I appreciate you guys so much. Yeah, go ahead and copy a raid message. Go ahead and copy a raid message real quick, and then we're going to go off, and we're going to go raid Maddie Munster. All right. Thanks so much for being here, you guys. I love you all so much, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. All right. Get ready. Three, two, one. Bye, guys.